Darnell, what's going on? Well, one thing, that's enough. Come on, watch that camera. I'm trying to take care of some business. Come on, move that camera. walking by and all of a sudden I see this man laying on the floor there and when he was laying there I could see that he was hurt so I came over by him and I started rubbing his back and Do you know then who this the man was? Uh, no, I don't know him. I've never seen him before in my life. Ma'am, you said you seen what was going on. Hold on. Yes. Bring the camera over here. I didn't see everything. I just I just was walking by and I saw this man Please. Oh yeah, I was just walking around and like I said, he was tripped and fell. Hold it, Mark, something just ain't right. I've been knowing you a long time and something that seemed like, uh, tell me, what, what really happened? Well, I, I guess I can't really lie to you. I mean, he, he paid me off to tell you that. Uh, Kingfish, Tim Moore paid you off to tell a lie. What did he pay you? Yeah, he said you got scared. He gave me $100. He oh, got yeah. scared. Uh, my good man. I have to tell you, you've been bamboozled. I want to get a shot of this. Look what he got. A one dollar bill. Kingfish told him it was a hundred dollar bill. You've been bamboozled. Well, he's, uh, he's, my, he's been my friend for a long time. I listen to him on the radio. I'm a good fan of his. So. You listen to him on the radio? Yeah, so now I got bamboozled by him in person. So ha! Think of this. Well, what was that man's name again? His name was Kingfish. A sna snakey skin? No, ma'am, Kingfish. Oh, sneaky snake. Kingfish. Oh, oh, King King Snake. Uh, I'm I'm not good with names, but whatever his name was, he seemed like such a nice man, and his his, so, his story seemed so credible. I just don't know why people had to lie like that. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. Thanks, ma'am. Hey, Amber. I gotta go see the kingfish and don't have this door. There he is. Ooh, Mr. Kingfish. What are you doing in here, Mr. Kingfish? What's going on? <laughs> What's going on here, Mr. Kingfish? You done ran off over here to the child hall. What are you doing? <laughs> Ooh, that's a nice table setting right there. Hey. Woo! <laughs> look at here, look at here. Mr. Kingfish. Uh. Now what are you doing over here? <laughs> what it look like I'm doing? <laughs> Mr. Kingfish. Uh, what? Aren't you ashamed of yourself? <laughs> You ought to be ashamed of yourself, you know. Yeah. I know, I've heard about you bamboozling that blind man over there, Mr. Kingfish. <laughs> Mr. Kingfish. What? <laughs> what? Aren't you ashamed of yourself how you bamboozled that blind man I over there? I didn't bamboozle the yes, blind you did. man. Yes, you did. I gave the boy money. You gave him a dollar, and you told that man that you gave him a hundred dollars. <laughs> well, if my math is right, I gave him one dollar. Uh, I gave him one. Now I owe him two zeros. And zero plus zero is nothing. <laughs> we <That's> even. <laughs> Mr. Kingfish, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. We even now. <laughs> You're even. Bamboozling the blind man? <laughs> that makes you feel good, Mr. Kingfish? Well, I'll tell you what we do. Like the uh, gym should. Uh, this Black History Month, and so uh, I gotta tell the whole truth. I love Mr. Chillin. 
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'll be back in about 15 minutes. Get yourself a break. <laughs> Come to me. Come to me, Piggy Wiggy. <laughs> Mm-hmm.